In this video, you're going to get the latest Star Citizen news, including Alien Week. My apologies for the lack of videos in the past few weeks. Things have been a little bit hectic and it should return back to normal soon. This means regular videos as usual. To start off, Alien Week is just starting. So this is a great opportunity for you to pick up your favorite alien ship, skins, and armor. This includes the Banu Merchant, which is a very popular one. So go check it out. This is your opportunity to pick it up. This week's roadmap roundup doesn't have too many things, but they're adding to 3.20 little by little. It says wheeled vehicle handle improvements have been added to the 3.20 branch. And it says updates and improved to the current ground vehicle movement parameters and simulation, allowing for more robust tuning and identity between various ground vehicles. So that's going to be interesting to see once we get our hands on 3.20. When it comes to the progress tracker, they've added the Mirai Furry and the Tumbro Storm. Before we move forward, I'd like the new people to know that we're doing a giveaway for the month of June. This time, it's the Mirai Furry. If you want to participate, all you got to do is subscribe and leave a comment in any video between the month of June. Let's move on. The latest patch for 3.19.1 PTU has just a few bug fixes, but I'm going to mention them here. Claimed and delivered ships load into wrong location when primary residence is changed, so that's been fixed. ASAP fails to register ship destruction in specific conditions, allowing retrieval of permanently destroyed ships and hindering insurance claims, so that's been fixed. Unable to retrieve ships after player disconnects ungracefully while in the process of retrieving a ship, so that's been fixed. Also, it has three server crashes as well as a backend service crash fix. You guys already know what to do. Leave a like, subscribe. I'll see you on the next video.